Welcome back to my channel guys. It's 1 a.m. I'm at Brigade right now signing out. This is my first time ever signing out at Brigade. I made sure to get a copy of my leave form, okay, just to be on the safe side. Then I had to drive an hour to the airport because I'm flying at OKC. Y'all, I didn't have any luggage. I didn't have anything, no makeup, no hair stuff. I left Fort Sill with only the clothes on my back and that is just because I waited till last minute to pack fell asleep and then was about to my flight if I didn't leave immediately. But it's all good, I'm here. My mom picked me up at the airport. She's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> We drove straight from the airport to Fort Jackson. It was about a six hour drive. Fort Jackson, South Carolina is where Jalen's AG Bullock schooling is and I'm surprising her. She has no idea I'm coming. Jalen and the rest of the AG students are staying at the hotel and the plan is my mom's gonna go in all normal cause she's expecting my mom and then I'm gonna show up at the door after and just surprise her. This is what the inside of the hotel looks like. I went to the bathroom to try to get myself together but there's honestly no getting this together like i look a hot mess but that's okay that's okay i'm just on my way to her hotel room now i am going to put the phone down in front of her room on the left side i'm going to show you guys my viewpoint and then on the right side i'm going to show you guys my mom's viewpoint because i told her to record in there too and jalen's used to us recording because me and my mom were very similar we record everything so She's not reacting to my mom recording because my mom records everything. She records more than me. You shouldn't have to buy this stuff. Okay. <laughs> what? There's no women here. Yeah. Really? Yeah. That was creepy. You sure? After this surprise, my mom and I helped Jalen pack out her stuff and move out of her room. She has so much stuff, so much stuff. I was able to go shopping for some clothes because like I said earlier, I didn't bring anything on this trip. I just came with my backpack and my phone, so I don't have any clothes, but I was able to get some from her closet and she has some really cute stuff, guys. I can't promise she's getting anything that I took back. It took us a couple hours to pack everything up because what I'm showing you guys isn't even a quarter of the stuff that she has but we were able to get it done, most of it that night. We'll have to come back in the morning, but this is us taking stuff out to the car and packing it up. What is wrong with what? you? What? <laughs> you just hit me with your car. <laughs> <laughs> and so now you owe me over two million dollars and five million. <laughs> I just saw you run into the car. <laughs> what is wrong Literally, with you? you've got a large break account. I don't know, maybe you're a cuddles. <laughs> What is wrong with you? You're gonna get used to shouting at Shikmi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bye, I love you. I love you too, baby. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> the next morning, we woke up at a hotel. So Jalen stayed in her room at her hotel. And then my mom and I got another hotel to stay at. And like I said, I don't have any makeup. I waited to the last minute and didn't even have time to grab my makeup bag. That's how y'all know I was in such a rush. I had gone to sleep. I had closed my eyes. It was 2.30 in the morning. I was like, let me just close my eyes for 30 minutes. Then I'm gonna wake up and pack. I opened my eyes. It was 4.30. My plane was leaving in an hour and it takes an hour to get to the airport. I hopped in the car as fast as I could. And now I'm using whatever I can find in my mom's makeup bag to get right for today. I wanna look my best today. Jalen is graduating from Bolick, which is basic officer leadership course. And she's graduating from AG Bolick, which is so amazing. I wanted to go with AG so bad. My mom is an AG officer. <laughs> <laughs> AG 
AG is just where it's at. I still haven't been able to post my brunch night videos, but they will be coming in due time. I promise you guys. I promise you guys these videos are coming. Time management does not get any easier after graduating West Point. Let me tell you that. If you're a cadet listening to this video, if you're watching me right now, it doesn't get any easier. Use that time at West Point to learn how to manage your time because you're still going to have the, those same problems once you graduate in commission. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you going? Work. Right before we left, June dialed in and we spoke to her for a little bit. She wanted to know what was going on today. We filled her in. She's going to call again after the graduation is done. Today is the actual day of Jalen's graduation. I'm just so proud of her. She graduated after me, is graduating bullet and starting her actual job at her actual unit way before me. I haven't even started my school. This is just something I didn't want to miss and it was so close to holiday block leave. I just took an extra four days just so I can be here for her graduation. I'm just really excited, really happy to be out of the state of Oklahoma. <laughs> it's 8.30ish. We're supposed to leave at 8, <laughs> but... We're going to go to Jalen's hotel room again this morning. She's at rehearsal, so she won't be back. We're gonna try to pack up all our entire room. We started last night. That girl has so much stuff. I went shopping for closet yesterday when we were packing all her stuff up. And she has really nice stuff, so it came in handy. When we finally got to Jalen's hotel room that morning, we thought she was gonna be already at her rehearsals, but she was still cleaning out her room some more. And look at her! Look how beautiful she looks! She looks beautiful! beautiful. Thank you. We just helped her move her stuff until she had to go for rehearsals. This is us packing up all her stuff in Ruby. That's another reason we decided to drive down here instead of flying down here because we not only packed up Ruby, we also packed up the car that we drove down here because there is so much stuff. So it took two full cars to get all her stuff. And her in her uniform packing this up is giving graduation day when all those cadets who just commissioned were packing up their cars and getting ready to drive who knows where. Jalen is wearing heels with her pants. I love the heel pant combo. It is so powerful. I always feel like I look crazy when I do it, but <laughs> that's just because I can't walk in heels. We did go back inside and help ourselves to some of Jalen's food since, you know, she can't take it with her. And then we headed out to go to the graduation. I guess they canceled rehearsal or something cause she didn't go to rehearsal, but she had to be behind seats at 945 and it is 940 right now. The auditorium where the graduation is happening is right around the corner from the hotel though. So we were able to drop her off. Look at her go. The next time we see her y'all, she's going to be walking this stage. Yes, ma'am. And look at her in those heels. When we got inside, my mom recognized the auditorium because this is the same auditorium she graduated from like 20 years ago. I graduated from the same auditorium. Oh, so cute. Uniform. No. She also recognized the guest speaker. Apparently that was her triple C commander and they still stay in touch to this day. And so when she saw her, she went up on stage and this is them hugging before the ceremony. They're both full birds now. So they've come such a long way. This also shows how small the military is. Like the connections you make will last a long time. They will matter, especially if you plan on making this a full-time career. <music>
for, ma'am. No, you can't because the S1 shots only open from 3 o'clock to 7 o'clock on a full moon. <laughs> only on even days.